Many people don't realize that in Louisiana, a property insurance company has certain obligations under Louisiana law to treat you with good faith. Now this actually means a couple of very specific things in Louisiana. The first thing, and maybe one of the hardest to figure out, is that an insurance company cannot adjust your claim in an arbitrary or capricious manner. What does that mean? That means that before an insurance company does something or doesn't do something, it has to have a reason. It has to have a good faith basis for doing what it did or what it didn't do. This usually is in context of money. For instance, I might know it's going to cost me $100,000 to repair my house after a fire, but the insurance company might only pay me 10 or 20. If that's the case, then I have to figure out if the insurance company had a good faith reason to underpay me so grossly. If it turns out that they did not and they behaved in an arbitrary and capricious manner, that actually could be good news for me because I might be entitled to penalties, attorney fees, and court costs, which means I might be able to recover far in excess of the 100000 that I was owed to begin with. Another thing that constitutes bad faith in Louisiana and also is surprisingly common is when an insurance company makes a misrepresentation in the adjusting of a claim. This can happen in a few ways. Sometimes an insurance company is not completely honest when they're talking to you about your claim. Sometimes they send someone out who blames your claim on something else that wasn't actually the cause. These types of things are examples of an insurance company making a misrepresentation such that it actually causes bad faith and again creates the opportunity for you to recover penalties, attorney fees, and court costs. Your insurance company may not treat you fair during your insurance claim, but as you can see, it can be hard to tell if your insurance company is committing bad faith. It's very important to sit down with someone that's knowledgeable about Louisiana bad faith law in order to tell you whether you might be entitled to attorney fees, court costs, and penalties. If you don't do that, you may be leaving significant recovery on the table, and it may be the difference between you getting back in your house and you having to make significant compromises and have a house that isn't as good quality as it was before.